Yeah. Okay, so tell us a little bit about your films and how what you do. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, my name's Bertie, and I make short films predominantly on YouTube uh, and just the kind of internet in general. I've been doing it for four years now, and um, yeah, I don't know. They're sort of you're taking indie movie kind of sensibilities and applying them to a kind of the online spectrum. Spectrum, I guess. Um, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's fun. I enjoy it. Hopefully, they won't be short films for much longer. Hopefully, they'll be long films. Uh, but uh, yeah, for now, I'm experimenting and learning, and uh, yeah, having using my channel as a way to uh, yeah refine my abilities, I guess. And do you have a particular genre that's your favourite, or do you try to like mix it up? Uh, I think I. I mean, I I don't make horror films. That they're not really comedies. I think they're all just kind of dramas I guess uh, sort of um, dramas kind of driven by like people my age because obviously it's sort of I can relate to it and I put a lot of my own experiences into the films so I'd say yeah kind of indie dramas is the the general uh, niche and uh, which is the favorite film that you've made and just tell us the basic plot of it um oh it's tricky it's like choosing your favorite child um, yeah they all have aspects I'm very proud of they all have aspects that I change and that I, I'd want to uh, improve upon. I'd probably say the film, I'm, I'm editing a film right now um, that we shot about a month ago called Stomping Grounds uh, and it's the first one we're going to do the film festival circuit with and that would probably be my favourite one um, and obviously it's not out there anymore, uh, right, it's not out yet so uh, I could be lying uh, but I would, yeah I don't know, it's about a, a tap dancer who uh, is a little too into his tap dancing. Um, and yeah, I'm very proud of it so far. So I hope people like it when it when it comes out. That, I think that'd be my favourite, but in a by a long shot. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm intrigued already by uh, your yeah, description just, of it. He just loves the tap dancing. He just <laughs> yeah. He uh, it's yeah. It's a film of people talking in rooms, and every now and then tap dancing in rooms, which sounds really boring and rubbish. But uh, I, hopefully, it won't be. Yeah. yeah. So um, how is it you became um, here at uh, VidFest today? So like, tell us a bit about your journey and how you got here and like how it feels to, to be here with your work at VidFest. Um, yeah, so I... Yeah, how did I end up here? It's a good question. I just sort of fell into it. Um, well, I knew a lot of my kind of peers, a lot of people I work with have been coming here for years and uh, they said it's a really nice place to, to meet people and, and kind of put yourself out there and, and, and you know sell some merchandise and stuff like that so I uh, yeah I came here last year with a suitcase full of posters not really knowing what to expect and uh, I was very pleasantly surprised that a decent amount of people knew who I was and I had loads of incredibly engaging and interesting conversations with different people and I love admiring the cosplay and and stuff like that and I I, I yeah I think nerd culture and kind of I mean I guess it's not it's not as niche as it used to be but like seeing all these people here being able to kind of express themselves and be themselves and there's everything from Marvel to Star Wars to, to comics to artists to, to everything I think anyone with any interest in popular culture or even less popular culture um, there's something there for them so I think yeah it's a really it's just a nice environment to be in yeah no definitely it's like everyone can finally let their inner geek out and enjoy it <laughs> yeah I mean it's I don't know, you'll, you'll, you'll see these people in, in costumes that are just so elaborate and so huge and first of all you're thinking you must be so sweaty, I, I'm so, I feel so bad for you. Um, but, but just more than anything, you, you can't help but just admire the craft and, and yeah, I don't know, I think, yeah, I don't know, celebrating one's passion uh, is, is, a, is a very healthy, nice thing and this is, that's what it is, just people celebrating what they're into and what they love. Yeah. So now it's time for you to uh, tell us that where we can find all your work. So now you can uh, sell yourself. Tell us where all of your links are, like everything. Uh, right, my links. Let me some fat links for you. Well, um, my most of my stuff's on on my YouTube channel, which is just youtube.com forward slash Bertie. So that's easy to remember. And then my Twitter is Bertie Gilbert, but with the vowels in. Gilbert not there because someone else took that and yeah. it's a whole bloody so it's Bertie Gilbert and then I don't know I have an Instagram you know all sorts but I'd say YouTube is the main one because that's where my uh, my work lives but that's yeah that's me fantastic and I wish you the best of luck with the festival circuit yeah oh yeah thank you I yeah I don't know 
what to expect, but hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully it'll be fun. Yeah, great talking to you.